อังกุยจอกองจุนอยู่ในปากกาบรรโตกระจมราการในติดที่สามนาคาหนึ่งประดอบิจการจุนเตอร์กรมมิตรวีกาเปกไดลูกนนจีตำบลบรรโตกางเงียบบักลวนสมจึงขอบคุณมิสเตอร์ประธานผมถูกต้องขอให้ผมได้รับการอนุญาตให้ผมเดินทางไปก็จะมีสมาชิกสมาชิกมนุษย์ยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึดมิสเตอร์ประธานผมได้รับการอนุญาตให้ผมเดินทางไปก็จะมีสมาชิกสมาชิกมนุษย์ยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึดยึดมันติดในขยมนั่งนิยมยึด Now we understand that both of the documents are two of only three so-called trunk of district records for which there is in fact an original held held at the Tulsa Museum. Accordingly, given our concerns about the provenance and chain of custody of the trunk of district records as a whole, we request that the chamber obtain permission for these originals to be added to our case file. Additionally, we note that these lists are they are not prisoner lists or execution lists, but simply. Lists. One apparently from Zhapiang Tom Chung and the other from Popel. What therefore does the prosecution want to suggest exactly as to their relevance? Without any further concrete evidence as to what happened to the people. On this list, uh, the reference to these lists alone is uh, inconsequential and uh, with zero value. Also, uh, in the sex this section on the treatment of the Vietnamese and the Khmer Krom, um, the prosecution made their first reference to document E3-2048, a document which they highlight repeatedly at various points in their document presentation. Um, in this first reference, the prosecution highlighted a page which it described as um, a May 1977 list from Popel of 64 Khmer families evacuated from uh, Vietnam. Uh, here, Mr. President, our first objection is again uh, about four. Uh, this document E3-2048 is not only uh, a photocopy for which there is no located original, but it appears to be a photocopy of a photocopy. And in addition, the document appears to be a compilation of various correspondence, um, yet someone has gathered, it, has gathered it together and presented it as a uh, single document. And again, the questions of who, when, why and how become critically important. And these concerns, uh, together with the prosecution's heavy reliance on this document, magnify um, our concerns about provenance and chain of custody and make it even more necessary for the chamber to search uh, for the document's originals. Uh, moreover, and just as with the uh, previous two lists referred to, without any clear evidence uh, about what happened next to the people featured on the list, the list itself can only be of very limited relevance. Um, Mr. President, the prosecution round out its section on treatment of the Vietnamese and um, the Khmer Krom by referring to Henri Locard's report called Tram Kok District in the Grip of the Khmer Rouge. 
That is D313 slash 1.2.16. And addition to, uh, in addition to the general objections uh, I have already mentioned in connection with this report, we also object that Lokar's report uh, itself is irrelevant. He is simply doing uh, what we are doing, uh, analyzing the so-called Tramcock district records. Moreover, we challenge whether Henri Locard has uh, expertise that uh, may truly add value to such an analysis. The prosecution characterizes uh, Locard as a quote-unquote historian, um, political science, quote-unquote, and quote-unquote leading expert on Cambodia and the Khmer Rouge, uh, and they do that in their witness summary, which is document number E305-6.4 at ERNs 0098-6615 in English, 0099 um, 7433 in French, and the Khmer is not available. Uh, however, our understanding is that Lokar has degrees specializing in the English language and is therefore, it is therefore unclear what particular expert insights that uh, he can bring, he could bring. If it is simply about him spending a long time in Cambodia and being curious about uh, Khmer Rouge issues, then I suppose any number of ordinary Khmers might uh, also fit the bill. Uh, prosecution further admits in its witness summary that Lokar was previous, previously employed uh, by them. And we have previously said in the light of his employment with the prosecution that Craig Edgerton's testimony um, should be taken with a grain of salt, as I believe your chamber has said as well. And we would therefore say that Henri Locard's testimony, uh, or his, his, his book, or his, or his works, given uh, his employment history and irrelevant qualifications, should be taken with a bag of salt. Uh, Mr. President, Your Honours, I move now on to the next topic, the treatment of Lono uh, soldiers and officials. The prosecution third uh, thematic focus is on the treatment of Lono soldiers and officials within uh, Tramcock district and at Krang Tachan. Before we um, go to Um, then I will start with um, talking about the prosecution's third thematic focus, uh, which is on the treatment of uh, Lono soldiers and officials within Trangkok district and at Trang Tachan. Before um, we go to our objections on specific documents, we would like to raise uh, the general objection that um, even if Lono soldiers and officials had been targeted, and we do not concede that, this, of course, must be considered in a historical and geopolitical context. Targeting itself, if it happened, would not, of course, be strange in light of the fierce civil war with Lono, which immediately preceded the decay. As a matter of fact, any country might have done the same at that point in time. Now going to E3-2120, which is mandatory is book called The Chain of Terror, and which is the first document uh, relied on uh, in, in this theme by the pro prosecution to which we wish to object. Uh, supplementing the general objection we have already made regarding the need for Meng Tri E to testify about his methodology, 
Uh, uh, we note that he published this study under the auspices of DC Chem's uh, Searching for the Truth uh, publication. We also note that on the case file is what happens to be an earlier draft of Meng Chi's book, which contains comments and suggestions from Yuk Chang, who is, of course, the DC Chem director, uh, comments from a person identified as Steve, who is presumably Steve Heather, and a third unidentified author. And uh, Mr. President, Your Honor, I would like to draw your attention to one of those comments. In one passage, uh, Meng Chi Yi relays how an interviewee could uh, describe prisoners in sub-district militia centers plowing fields alongside uh, non-prisoners. And this interviewee could conclude that, and I quote, even the people without the blame worked very hard, so prisoners must have been forced to work even harder, unquote. Um, following immediately on from this, uh, from this an annotation from Yuk Chang, which reads, and I quote, you know I hate this paragraph. It makes the survivors sound too weak. People have to work hard. Here I think we refer to people's rights and freedoms being taken away. Or maybe just delete this paragraph. Unquote. This appears, uh, Mr. President, on an older version of the same document, E3-2120, on the case file at English ERN 001056.83. In English, um, nowhere else. Although uh, Meng Chi Yi retained the passage in the final version, uh, this example of a comment from DC Chem's director shows that it is white, that its widely accepted status as a neutral organization may in fact be questionable and it may better be considered as an advocacy group. Um, in addition, and as with Henri Ocar, uh, to the extent that Meng Chi Yi's conclusions in the book are drawn simply from an analysis of the Trumcock district records, then we would object that they are irrelevant uh, unless the prosecution uh, can satisfy the chamber of his particular expertise. Of course, to the extent that the book is based on interviews that Meng Chi conducted, then its content may be relevant. However, even in this case, it would be necessary for him to come and testify uh, about his research methodology. The next document, uh, Mr. President, to which we refer in this section on the so-called targeting of Lono soldiers and official is E3-4095, um, and it's the Krang Tachan Interrogators Notebook, as it is called. This is a document uh, we also refer to at length in our own document presentation. Um, however, we wish to make the following objections with respect to the prosecution's use of this document. Uh, first, we note uh, that the cover page of this document does indeed bear the title uh, Fifth Confession, Contemptible Traitors, Pol Pot and Ing Seri, a title clearly added after the DK period and signaling without uh, any doubt that this document has been tempered with. In addition, we note that the prosecution's summary of the document's relevance pointed to, among other things, um, the reason for certain prisoners' arrests. Now here again, we feel that the double standard returns. Given that this document is apparently the result of a uh, prisoner's interrogation and confession, it would seem again that the prosecution is seeking to rely on the contents of a confession. The inclusion of this document uh, in the prosecution section on the supposed targeting of Lono soldiers and officials prompts us to make a number of additional points in relation to this document.
First, uh, when reviewing the contents of the confessions within this document, it seems that no one in the document is being interrogated simply to determine their rank uh, within the Lono Army or administration. Prisoners were interrogated because they were perceived uh, to have done something. Um, this is illustrated by even the very first example in the notebook. Uh, this entry relates to a man named Yuan Heng, uh, a non-commissioned soldier who allegedly, and I quote, had a grudge against a comrade in trade affairs and attempted to axe him to death, end of quote. English ERN 00747237, Khmer 00271090, and French 00721206. We can compare this with other uh, examples with which the chamber is already familiar, including people mentioned in the same notebook who were not uh, well known soldiers and officials. An example that we have discussed at some length in this regard is the family of Mia Soka. They too were not arrested arbitrarily, but had in fact been accused of plotting to overthrow their commune chief. And I might add that um, the husband of um, Rod was also accused of having raped a new person. Second, Mr. President, the notebook is clearly a very brief summary, a brief summary of the interrogations. Alone, therefore, it should be considered inadequate evidence of the reasons for a person's arrest. What we need to see, for example, is uh, documents from the sending locations uh, and documents indicating what happened to the people next, such as a possible execution or a release list. Our objection in this respect applies also to other documents which the prosecution used in this section of its uh, document presentation, namely the documents E3-2107, E3-2049, and E3-2432. Allow me to add a few additional um, comments in relation to one of those three documents, which is E3-2048. Um, the specific document within the compilation to which the prosecution referred at this point in its presentation was the April 1977 report from Tapem Commune, Chief Kit uh, to Ankar. Uh, ERN English 00276564, Khmer 00079791, and French 00611611. As the prosecution highlighted, uh, this document seems to suggest uh, that law and all soldiers were being identified on that basis of their identity as such at that time. Now, of course, our general objection still applies here, uh, that there needs to be additional evidence corroborating the fate of the people identified in documents such as this. However, uh, this document and its date are also significant, we believe. And that is because it seems that from approximately mid-1977 onwards, there appears, to be, there appears to be a shift, at least in the so-called Trump Cop district records, with people being identified on the basis of their, of their former Lono military or administrative rank. As far as we can see, uh, these types of documents uh, do not seem to exist uh, before before that time. Therefore, it might suggest that there are in fact two distinct periods, uh, before and after mid-1977, which seems to be in line with Peck Chim's testimony uh, last Friday and the Southwest Zone cadre statement about the meeting uh, shortly after the liberation 
uh, in Takiyo provincial town, during which Tamok said that, and I quote, soldiers with the rank from second lieutenant to colonel were not to be harmed, unquote. But Mr. President, Your Honours, to be clear, this is not a concession uh, that lone all soldiers and officials were targeted. Uh, obviously, uh, and as we have already said, further investigation into the provenance and chain of custody of the so-called Trumpock district records needs to be carried out uh, before they can be relied upon as key evidence and any conclusions drawn. Um, on another topic in relation to the same document, E3-2048, uh, I note that later in its presentation, uh, the prosecution highlighted uh, one passage in another document within the compilation, and that is a 2 May 1977 report from Pan of Popel Commune, English ERN uh, ERN 0037 until 4, Khmer uh, 0079090, and French 0061661. In the relevant passage, uh, point two of the report, Pan reported that, and I quote, the 106 military families, families smashed by Ankar, including those who died, totaled 393 persons, unquote. Now, on this subject, um, I would like to refer again to the testimony of witness Peck Jim during last week's hearings. As you may recall, Peck Jim explained that smashed has two meanings. It may refer to eliminating a person in the sense of uh, eliminating their erroneous mindset, and it may also mean eliminate in the sense of kill. Uh, now, we believe that the Chamber's position um, on the meaning of smash, as established in case 001, is overwhelmingly focused on the testimony of Dui. Uh, however, assuming it could be true that smash could have had a variable meaning during the decay, uh, we would argue that Beck Chim's testimony as to the meaning of the word smash is much more relevant in this situation than Duke's testimony. Why? Beck Chim was, after all, a Trumpcock district secretary during the DK, and the documentation appears to show that instructions as to people's fate were often sought from the district level. In addition, we know that the trial chamber considers him, Beck uh, Chim, to be a credible witness. According to our account, it relied you relied on Peck Jim's testimony a considerable 16 times in the case 002-01 judgment. So taking Peck Jim's definition of the word smashed or smash into account then, the fact is that it is possible that the reference to the smashing of the military families in E3-2048 might not in fact mean their execution. Perhaps it might mean the transfer to a re-education center or another administrative framework, for example, uh, or somewhere else. In any case, it requires further investigation uh, before conclusions can reasonably be drawn. Um, Mr. President, I will now make uh, very brief objections regarding documents in the next five themes uh, on which the prosecution focused uh, in its document presentation. First, uh, regarding the treatment and targeting of new people uh, in Trumpcock District, uh, our general objection here is that the prosecution did not show any documents proving that there was a policy to treat new people any differently from, uh, anyone, uh, from anyone else. And although I'm not allowed to react on what the prosecution said this morning, um, we heard him quote uh, from um, standing committee meetings, and the word, the crucial word in his uh, quote is, of course, the word among. Uh, it is being argued uh, that there are bad elements among the new people. New people as such are not bad. That is, uh, of course, also an important point of appeal. The next um, 
theme, Mr. President, is about people who were arrested for opposing or criticizing the revolution, uh, the party, or Ankara. Regarding uh, the supposed arrest of people who opposed uh, the party, we know that the prosecution principally relies on uh, interrogators' notebooks here. In particular, E3-4095, E3-2107, um, and D157.7, which is now um, E3-5827. Once again, uh, we refer you, therefore, to our objection in relation to the summary form of those notebooks and the fact that it is essential for us to have additional documentation to corroborate interrogators' notebooks and confirm the fate of the people mentioned within these notebooks. Otherwise, um, the evidentiary value of the information in the notebook alone, the notebooks alone is limited. Uh, next. Mr. President, it's about the people who were arrested in connection with food or uh, working conditions. I leave aside the, the, the rhetoric, the closing submission style rhetoric of this morning uh, from the prosecution. And what I do like to say is that regarding people supposedly arrested for stealing food or complaining about food or working conditions, uh, we know that this is something that has been clearly uh, contradicted uh, and I might add convincingly by all cadres who have so far testified. And we also pointed to other evidence uh, during our document presentation on Tuesday that suggested on the contrary that people uh, might be re-educated multiple times, including for much more serious offenses than just stealing uh, a coconut. In addition, and again, it is necessary to see additional uh, documentation that might complete the picture as the interrogation notebooks forming the basis of this evidence again offer only very summarized uh, information. It is also possible and, and probably quite likely uh, that information that a person might offer up in an interrogation might be totally different uh, from the reason for which they were actually arrested. And then the next theme, uh, Mr. President, people who were arrested uh, for trying to escape or moving around too freely. Uh, in respect of this um, theme, we contend that the evidence also must, of course, be seen in context. Um, if we take into account um, the security situation, uh, especially the severe internal factions and fomenting internal rebellion, which without any doubt existed within democratic Cambodia. It is uh, completely reasonable to see why a person might be detained at first if they were found to be somewhere where they didn't have permission to be. Whatever that may be, in any case, once again, the documents that the prosecution cited do not indicate what happened to the people after the arrest. And then, uh, concerning the arrest of children and the elderly, uh, we wish for now to comment on only one of the documents that the prosecution raised, uh, the document which he referred to as D157.36, and to which the chamber has now assigned the new E3 number uh, 8417. Uh, this document concerned uh, 23 and 24 March 1977 reports from Angroka and Ankar, including, as the prosecution highlighted, the arrest and confession of a 10-year-old boy as part of a group which had tried to flee. Um, our objection um, is here that the prosecution quoted selectively from this document because when you look at the document in full, there are key uh, details missing from the prosecutor's account which, gave, which give the uh, event a different color. Because the boy was captured in a group of people who, and I quote, had two pistols, unquote, and many 79-type bullets, unquote, which doesn't exactly give the same rosy picture of childhood innocence as the prosecution would like us to believe. Uh, for, uh, 
The UN numbers that I'm referring to, Mr. President, are English 0036369050, Khmer 00270989, and French 00607873. Um, now I turn to the authorities' procedures for arrests and executions. Um, in this theme, the prosecution also briefly presented two documents uh, in, respect it, in respect of the theme concerning uh, these procedures for arrest uh, and execution. The first was Henri Locard's report again, and um, from this document, uh, D313-1.2.16, uh, the prosecution quoted the passage which indicated that, what, that there was uh, no documentation of quote unquote revenge killings um, of the new people and that um, quote killings by DK were centrally, centrally planned and that um, as in similar regimes the Nazi or the Stalinist varieties bureaucrats and executioners had completely surrendered their free will to the party unquote. Our objection here is actually that we completely fail to see how this is relevant and prohibitive at all. It is simply an unsubstantiated shopping list of uh, very tired cliches. Um, as for the second document, uh, the film Deacon of Death, E3 slash 2316R, uh, we have a number of concerns as to the documents or the film's probative value that we intend to investigate it before uh, coming back to it and commenting in our closing submissions. Um, in particular, we can see the setting is not a legal setting, but appears to be a form of uh, testimonial therapy. And to this end, we need to investigate the methodology undertaken in order to be able to rely on uh, the information that divulged in this, uh, in this film. And secondly, we also need to, to verify various details, including the identities of the people featured, the location, and whether the English uh, subtitles are in fact accurate. Uh, and this could take some time given the fact that the documentary is one hour and uh, four minutes long. Um, then the use of hot methods in interrogation, uh, that was the prosecution's last, uh, uh, third last team. Theme, sorry. Um, as we have presented contrary evidence on this topic in our own doc document presentation, we will not say now anything further about this matter uh, at this point. The prosecution's uh, second last theme in its document presentation was the use of Prang Chan documents in further interrogation of others. And, uh, here the prosecution presented a single document, E3-2012, which allegedly was an 11 July 1977 report from prison chief An on the confession of a prisoner named Sin Yung. Uh, now, as the um, prosecution highlighted, this document contained two handwritten unsigned uh, annotations. The first regarding Sin Yung and reading, quote unquote, to be smashed. And the second regarding two people who uh, Sin Yung identified and which read, quote unquote, to be arrested. As this document only exists as a photocopy, however, it is impossible uh, to verify whether these annotations were written in um, red ink, which uh, witness Peck Jim explained last week was apparently a distinctive feature of such annotations. It is also unclear uh, whose handwriting it is and when it was uh, uh, annotated to the document. And finally, Mr. President, this document is one of several in, uh, again, an apparent compilation, and therefore our same objection uh, and concerns as to the provenance and chain of custody apply. Um, the last point in the prosecution's um, document presentation is the reporting to the district um, and from the zone to uh, Phnom Penh. 
we have a few objections about the three documents that the prosecution highlighted in this section. Uh, first, let me turn um, to the first docu two documents, uh, that is documents E3-2109 and E3-4085, uh, which the prosecution described as monthly reports from Kain Tachan. Um, our objection is that uh, neither document actually stipulates that they are reporting about Kain uh, the name Kanta Chan, or rather uh, Re-Education Center 105, is never uh, mentioned in this document. Also, more specifically, the first document, uh, E3-2109, includes other information on, for example, the issuance of rice to Samrong district and of manioc to Toteung Tignai. Uh, these details make it arguably unlikely that the document is a Krang Tachan document. Uh, it may be a district document, but this has not, in our view, been established. Uh, the last document is a very interesting document, uh, which featured in the prosecution's presentation was the document number E3-853, uh, which was a report of uh, the southwest zone to Ankar. Uh, presumably at the center, dated the 3rd of June 1977. Um, our objection in this regard, Mr. President, is that the prosecution appears to have presented the information uh, selectively and uh, omitted key details. And these key details uh, include the following. Uh, first, the report was entitled uh, Report Number 10, which would imply that there are reports uh, 1 to 9. If there are any, where are they? Uh, secondly, but more important, uh, while the report appears to describe uh, a very serious defense situation within the zone, with many enemy uh, activities taking place, the defense section of that report is only about one quarter of its total length. And it doesn't seem to reflect paranoia. Uh, if anything, it seems uh, to be uh, modest considering, considering the events it describes, including the Chan Rengzi force attack, uh, the firing of enemy shells into DK territory, the movement of Vietnamese troops into the country, uh, the digging of trenches, and most vividly, and I quote, the enemy uh, launching their activities by burning children alive, unquote. And you can find that on English ERN 00185. Uh, 243 uh, and Khmer 005 uh, 0025 and French 002975. Finally, uh, in the document, uh, the Southwest Zone reported to the center that it would take um, the following quote-unquote, measures for the future. All levels must be put on full alert, and all enemy tricks and activities must be kept under 24-hour surveillance, but very quietly. Now, these steps, which also appear to be the only directive sent from the zone down to its lower levels, are, besides being very proportionate and reasonable, far too far too. Uh, generic to enable conclusions to be made about treatment of people in individual cases. Mr. President, Your Honour, that concludes our comments concerning uh, the prosecution's document presentation on the Trump Cop cooperatives and Grand uh, Chan. Next, regarding the civil party lead co-lawyers uh, presentation. Um, at this stage, also given the limited time available, our objections will only, only be very brief. Uh, but of course, I know that we plan to provide detailed uh, comments in our closing submissions and on other oca occasions as appropriate. Um, in short, we object to the lead co-lawyers technique of extensively quoting uh, from applications of civil 
civil parties uh, who are not going to appear in this courtroom. This is especially so where the testimony may go to the ex conduct of the accused. Now, as we briefly said on Monday, our view is that uh, document hearings are intended to give the parties us uh, an opportunity to highlight for the chamber uh, and the public key documentary evidence, documentary evidence uh, on the case file that may not otherwise be explored in court. We believe, therefore, um, that the intention is for us to focus on documents other than statements of witnesses and civil parties who are in principle capable of testifying here in this courtroom. It follows that these hearings should generally focus on contemporaneous documents that can establish facts and uh, corroborate or contradict witness testimony and memories. And on Monday, the lead co lawyer said that she would speak on behalf of civil parties who had not yet testified in court. In fact, however, the six civil parties who were featured on Monday will never testify in court because the legal lawyers did not request their appearance and neither did any other party. And in this context, um, highlighting those civil party applications by reading them into the record uh, word for word amounts to, we believe, allowing those civil parties to sort of quasi-testify yet preventing our client, Nunchia, uh, the other parties and the chamber from asking follow-up uh, questions, uh, testing uh, that evidence. Obviously, uh, we believe that such a practice cannot have any place uh, in this court. And finally, and I will conclude, uh, Mr. President, Your Honours, and on a more general note, it is clear that it is necessary for us to have some more clarity from the chamber um, on the procedure for document hearings. Um, our client, Munchia, uh, for instance, was very angry um, at the chamber's treatment of the Kyu Sampan team on Tuesday, and we were surprised also giving that the evidence that they were presenting seemed, in our view, to be perfectly reasonable. So we do hope that uh, to have some more clarity on this uh, before the next uh, document hearing is uh, being held. Thank you very much. បាទសូមអរគុណលោកប្រធានតតនេះខ្ញុំសូមរៀបសួរអង្គ <coughs> ខ្ញុំសូមអនុញ្ញាតធ្វើការឆ្លើយតបទៅនឹងការដាក់បង្ហាញផុសតាំងរបស់ដំណើរសព្រាញ្ញាក៏ដូចជាដើមដឹងម
นุคือจีปัญหาได้ทั่วเอาเมียนดมไลในพอตางเตี้ยบมพอดให้จมหน่อยนี้อ่อนจมหน่อยเรียกบานเจงในสิ่งใดในน้อมบัญเจในกาปีสมนมเรื่องโซนโซนปีหรือโซนบุรุษหายเตี้ยโตนแต่หนึ่งดมไลในพอตางรบบลูกบนเกณฑ์นี้แต่ตัวยังน่ากระดอยเชียงบานพินเดชเคยทาในขนมสมเนรบบลูกบนเกณฑ์นั้นนู้ก็เมียนจมหน่อยได้บัญเจนเพียบมันปรากฏได้ได้โลกบานเลิกอัมพีพอตังพอตังตัวขี้นี่นกาตัวตัวบานเนิ่มมโหบอาหารนึกนงสกตรามเกาะได้ดำนางสะเพียญยาบานเลิกนึกนงไอกษาอีบยเลือดปรามการสับใบไดมีนลิกอีออนจีเพซาขมายโซนโซนหกสับรัมปีแปดสับรัมแปดสับรัมให้จมดอยนี้วิจีกาบังไฮมวยทาเมียนสะใสบัญเจาะอมปีทำมาโฮปาฮานในขนมสระตรามเกาะนู้มันเมียนเอาไว้จีจำนาตีหายโดยเช่นนี้วีเมียนจำนวนควายขี้เดียดได้ดำนางสะเปียนยามเหมือนบันอ่านต่อกันไล่หนุ่มเตะโต้งตัวหนึ่งสเปียนอาหารอีกได้ไอ้กษาอีใบเลยปรำปีหกสับได้จีไอ้กษาตรงปาริวัตสมโตไอกษาอีบเลอมร้อยสามสับประบุนได้เชตรงปาเดวัตเลยดอกมุ้ยใครบริจาคชนะนกาสนามจัดสับประมุ้ยดำเนินอีอันจีพิซาขมายโซนโซนหกสับบุญกาสับประมสมโตโซนโซนโซนประมุยสายประบุนหกสับประมบหกสับประมุยพิซาอังเลโซนโซนสายสับประมฮาปีแปดบุญพิซาบารังโซนโซนสายประบุนดับประบุนดับประบุนเขียนบาทสมอันจูนดอกสรองตาหนุ่ยมันนี่อันวัดเจสได้อย่างไหมตีมวยระบอบโฮมดอกใบถังยืนสมรัยบ้านกันลึกชนะมวยปอนประมุ่ยจัดสับประมุ่ยดูชนะยืนอันวัดภายในการะบอบโฮมดอกใบถังระบอบประจิจุนเนื้อตูเตียงโปรตีนงชนะมวยปอนประมุ่ยจัดสับประมุ่ยบ้านเจตูเตยปะกำหนดท้าสมรักเอาบ้านรบบดอกใบถังมือร้อยเพียร้อยมันเอาจอมอกดอกปีถังหรือดอกถังตีดูขึ้นในด้ายนึกนงตรงปาริวัตเลยปีเซไคทนูแมกราชนะมือปอนประมุ่นร้อยเจ็ดสับประมุ่ยเจ็ดสับพรำเจ็ดสับประมุ่ยดามิเลจีบายเลือมาพยายามอีอันชีพศาขมายโซนโซนโซนประมุ่ยสามสับห้าสับบุญพิศาอังเลโซนโซนสายสับประมุ่ยดอกบุญสามสับประมุ่ยพิศาบรังโซ
0 0 xong chưa nhỉ thạm bên nhà rồng ăn trại chiến I just want to note for the record that neither of the last two documents that are being discussed are documents we presented. These are documents that were on the list of documents Q7 Khan Sung was presented. I actually have no objection to them using this opportunity, but I just want the record to be very not responding to documents we presented. They are reading from the documents that they had back on Tuesday. They are reading from the documents that they had back on Tuesday. អ្វីដែលទាំងពីរនេះគឺថាវាមិនពាក់ព័ន្ធទៅនឹងបត់បង្ហាញឯកសាររបស់យើងខ្ញុំទេឥឡូវប្រធានខ្ញុំសូមអ
จะต้นนั่งจมดกาสมรจระบอบถนัดดึกนอมขนมกาวิโยกกัมพูชีกรามบุกวิ่งได้ตำนานสาเพียญาบันเลิกดำไปบังหันปีตุ่มนัวประดับอาวุธดำเนินดึกขนมระบอบกัมพูชีประชาธิปไตยหายจีบิเซคือเตะโต้นตัวหนึ่งดำบอลตามเกาะนี้ชาวบ้านยูเคนทาการเลือกล้างระบบสาธารณะเตะตรงเป็นหนึ่งพอตางได้จีสมดีระบบตัดสารจีเลคาสตรงมันเนี่ยได้บ้านโจรวมประชุมจีมวยหนึ่งกระนาคมดำไปเป็นยุลอมปีบ่มนองระบบองกาขนมกาวีดันดามยกกัมพูชีประชาธิปไตยคือมันทัดโจลในขนมกาปีพิซาดังดาวขนมเปนิตีอังจุนยิมเรียบานเจงเนสิกได้สำหรับมวยดำเนินเลขอีใบรอยดับพรำปีทไงตีดับปีใครกันยะชนะปีปอนดับบุญบานปมใบในโตโตเตี้ยถัดเนื้อขนมจุ่มหน่อยนี่แต่ถัดเนื้อขนมจุ่มหน่อยจ่อแหลกกันนะในจุ่มลวกประดับอาวุธโดยฉะนั้นเขียนบาทสมบัติเวกาชายตอบเตือนหนึ่งพอตั้งได้บานเลิกล้างดอยสาบเรียญยาเตะโต้งตัวหนึ่งกาวิโยกัมปุจิกรามิตรีโดยที่นี่ได้หนึ่งขนมกาปรปรดเลือดจุนจีดเวียดนามหนึ่งขมายกล่อมดอยสาบเรียญยาบานเลิกไอกษาจิตรันนักเตะโต้นั่งจมดอยนี่ก็ปนแต่ขนมปีปัจจุบันนี้ยื่นบันทึกการปีเพียซ่าตะลือการประพฤติเลือกรมโกดาวเจริญนุติหายดูชนะขยมบาทมันทึกการชายตอบเตะโต้นั่งจมดอยนี่ได้ต้องตื่นดังกาบบอสสมาธิที่เห็นนั่งมันตรีรัตการลุนนอลดำนางซาเปียญาบันเลิกไอเกซาอีเบย์เลิกมาเผยมวยมาเผยรบบอลโลกเอเมนตรียืนขยมบานผินนิดตื่นลือจมน้อยจังอ๋อได้ดำนางซาเปียบันโยงมีนประมวยจมน้อยก็ปนแต่มีปีจมน้อยในยีปีเละขณะตูเตอร์นังบุญจมน้อยในยีปีกะระไนเจริญปนแต่ขนมนุ่มขมิ้นจมน้อยนาหมุยบองไฮปีตุ่มเนี่ยตุ่มนงรูเวียงสกตรามเกาะตีคือมีนใจมีนจมดอยมุ้ยได้เหมือนมีนเพียบจะบาลอติดไฮกราวปีนุ้งคือมีนนิยมปีสระปรีกบะหนึ่งสระบัตีได้มีนชมูชินหนึ่งชมูทอยได้จีเนี่ยปลาปอเดมีนเอาเอียมินตรีนุ้งโดยเฉพาะการดอกสรองได้ดำนางสาบเรียญยายูธาวิบจวบเปียปอนหนึ่งสกตรามเกาะนี้คือมันเมนจิกาปฏิโดยซาขนมอัตบอดนู่คือนี่ยี่สมดาวแต่เลือดสกบัตตีหนึ่ง
sọc bay gặp các bà cứ chia à, tức đây đòi lại chúng nói trong cái ấy mưa tiết tiệt tông từ nâng pho tang rồi bỏ đầm nang xả bìa nhá đại ban lướt âm pi bớt làm ướp xinh xinh chỉ bị xé tiệt tông từ nâng cà lụi hộp cà lụi đốn cà đinh ti chôn sải hỏi từ từ tu tu chúng nói ní chúng ban vô sơ từ nâng cao lực lang rồi bỏ mê thủy vi cục bể đại ban bình chia âm pi xạ khay cam rồi bỏ lục chấn Cứ khai cam rồi bỏ ta chấn đại chi cái nạn sọc hai đường miên cam áp bị ban môi chìm luôn tiết ở đây cam áp bị ban môi chìm luôn tiết thả bọt là mưa tôi tay bẹp đi khi mình bình chun từ căng tại chân tê vì ai trời từ tua ca ốp rôm nai nóm hai trời ơi đỏ lên ruột luôn vĩnh đôi chân này chấm đợi đi vì miên phá tan tôi kia đại ông chủ nhiệm ra ai lực một vị cha nạp bàn chúng tôi xoay tọp từ nâng mê tử vi nôm mục đàm đăng rọt về ní mê tử vi nó một bàn lược Tùm rung bò đầm miên Pram rõ bọt đàm Mình đang rõ bọt về ní Đàm miên lệ Y bấy Lơ học mũi Sai sợ bấy Y bấy Lơ học buôn Hà sợ bàm phí Y bấy Lơ sai bàm buôn Bà sợ bàm bấy Y bấy Lơ học sợ bí Mà phê bí Y bấy lơ ha sắp học sắp làm buồn Nâng miên Cầm nát hai sắp chẳng lời Nơi chẳng phương mục Cả giả lấy xã chạc rõm sư bằng kết Đã miên lệ y bấy lơ ha sắp làm đọc làm buồn Một này, lúc mình thử vi cục bế có bàn lược vì chúng tôi đi hỏi đáy Đói hẹt thà Nghĩa tầng ổn đi Mình bàn mọc Bằng hai anh luôn chúng tôi một ổn chúng tôi chúng tôi Hai có khuyên Cũng rộng thà nâng hai Nông bế ảnh ảnh cột đáy Đối chân này, cả lược sẽ khai cam mùi Đảm bây Dược mọc ra ra nông rương bùm toàn tạm ní mình miễn tầm lây chìa phó tăng xâm rạp ai ôn chung dùm rẻ chưa bàn tì Chết sát đáy anh Mê thư vi Mà rì kì rô bàn lướt tha khu luôn chia nẹ non pịa rồi bỏ đào mình đừng rót về ní hỏi đài trời lăng mọc bằng hành chung phù mục 
องจุดจุดเรียกาคือที่กาบังไฮในทางไอทีมาเพย์ปรำปีขายบุญกันลองตอนนี้นึ่งมองประหารดอกบุญมาเพย์ใบนึ่งมาเพย์ใบจุดเรียกนี้สำหรับองจุลจุมเรียขยมโยธามันปีบาทโยเตปีปลัวดามันดังรับตัวเวนีเมตุวิดามันดังรับตัวเวนีมันอาจจะเนี่ยนอมเปียรบบอกนกระไดคลุนขนมกาพัดดอสักไข่กำบานเตจีบิเซคือเตี่ยโตงตัวหนึ่งเรื่องปรุงมตวนกับปอนต้าเมตุวิดามันดังรับตัวเวนีอาจจีเนียนอมเปียขนมกะระนัยได้เตะโต้งตัวหนึ่งสมนองมียางเตี้ยเมตุวีดามดังรถเวนีคลุนไอ้ก็ทลอบตัวตัวสกอลทาเมียนจมนัดจิตรันได้เขาขี้นึกขนมสักไข่กำรบบอดามดังรถเวนีเทียบจมูกหนึ่งตุ่มรุ่งปอดมีนได้บานได้จุนอองจมูกจมเรียกน้องเปย์กันลองเมาโดยมีนในขนมไอกระสาอีมุ้ยเลยมาเพย์ปรำใบปรำใบจมูกจีกับนอตหัดสามนาคาในเมาปรับบุญสายซับหาซับปรับบุญยืนเลยจมหน่อยโดยขยมบานเลิกจูนอองทุนยมแดงของเป็นนี้การพัดดอสักไข่กำการพัดดอพับบังไฮพอต่างระบบเมทีวีนอมุกดามดังรถเวนีจมพัวตุ่มรุ่งปอดมีนรบกวนกระไดคลุนขังเลือดได้เหมือนบ้านโจรวมนึกนงสาวนาการเนื้อเตนุวีเหมือนบ้านพัดดาวอากาศอ้อยเพียกีนงกาสูดดังดาวดำใบสไวโรกาเปิดบานเลยฮันนี้พอตางแบบนี้วีทเวอร์เอาดำไลในพอตางนู้เหมือนมีนดำไล่รอตีสมอกุลบ่าเอาคนจำเรียฝึกสมรักาสำหรับในสารณาตบบอกไปกี่หรือกระดาษประหารเอกสารคนลึกเปียปอนจมวยหนึ่งต้องให้ถ้ากอนตามเกาะหนึ่งกลางแต่ชั้นดอกปีนี้คืนท่าดอกที่เป็นจอบเฮ้ยให้บานจอบมุนเปรียบเลียได้อ่องจำเรียบานรุ่งเปิงตุกโดยเฉพาะสัมนาการในทั้งไงนี้อ่องจำเรียบประกาศพระอาเกจำนาคาสัมนาการตรมนี้ไอสัมนาการเลือกเตือนบรรทุกคือในทั้งไงชั้นที่บุญใครอุตพีชนะปีพอนดับพรำได้นั่งจับประดามปีมาวกรุบุญปรึกสามนาคาในไงจันดามสัปดาห์กล่าวนี้องค์จำเรียนนักเฟื่องสามนาคาสำหรับสักไข่กำสะใสไดมิทฮาสเนียมปีทีซีไดบิยูผมบุญรอยจัดสมบูรณ์ตามระยะประปวนเท่าตัวทรงพิกิจเรียบหนึ่งเจอโจร่วมตามเปรียบเลียบันกำหนดนี้ให้ประกอบไออันดุเรียมติคงแข็งรวมครวนจนจบเจ้าคือสมพรหนึ่งนวลเชี่ยตลอดเวลาบันติคงแข็งในอบตะกอเวนเจ้าเนื้อประกอบไอนองครวนปกติมาโจรวมสามนาคาวิ้งในไทยจันติบุญไข่อุตภีชนะปีพอนต์ปรำไอ้บานมุนมองประบวนปรึกสำหรับเจ้าสมเชิญครับเจ้า